The Scripps Howard Foundation honors excellence in photojournalism. The winner, Carolyn Cole with the Los Angeles Times for her portfolio covering major national and international events in 2015. For the dangerous migration of refugees fleeing their homelands in search of a better life in Europe, Carolyn Cole was there at the shoreline as overfilled flimsy boats carried wave after wave of immigrants. Her images showed the journey and the overwhelming problem for countries struggling to handle the influx of hundreds of thousands of people. She was in Baltimore amid the smoke and fires as protests over the homicide of Freddie Gray grew into violent riots and looting. She witnessed and documented the public outcry and the response from police and the Maryland National Guard in trying to enforce a curfew. And after terrorists carried out an orchestrated attack in Paris, killing 130 people and injuring hundreds more, Carolyn Cole traveled to the City of Lights to show how Parisians responded with moments of prayers and tearful remembrances amid ongoing fear and panic, all during a manhunt by police and soldiers in search of the terrorist attackers. Her work captured suffering, despair, anger, and shock. We know the story, we know the story of the refugee, we know this, that she's shown that in a visual way that every human being in the universe can understand and can read. Four of the more prominent stories of the year were a part of her portfolio. Um, and in each instance, um, she provided just a very raw, um, compelling narrative, visual narrative that uh, was um, compelling, it was uh, enlightening, um, and uh, very emotional. The word that kept coming to mind is impact. She makes extremely impactful photographs um, that are really telling the story in a way that grabs you and makes you pay attention. Presenting the Scripps Howard Award for photojournalism and a check for $10,000 to Carolyn Cole of the LA Times is Scripps Howard Foundation trustee, Rebecca Scripps Brickner. Um, I'm very honored by the Scripps Howard Foundation. I began my career at the El Paso Herald Post, a Scripps paper, where I got invaluable, <laughs> some of you remember that. <laughs> I got invaluable experience covering both sides of the U.S.-Mexico border. I could have never imagined at that time where photography would take me. Last year, I covered stories in 10 countries, including the Paris attack and the migrant crisis in Europe, both very tragic stories that continue to evolve. Over 3,000 refugees died last year trying to reach Europe. And just last week, 500 more migrants perished in the Mediterranean when their boat capsized after leaving Libya. I believe we can't close our eyes to the problems of the world and that the role of journalists is as important as ever. I'm proud to be a part of this journalism family. This year, I'm covering the presidential primaries, but I hope to use my award money next year on an environmental project fo focusing on the oceans. Finally, I'd like to thank my mother, Doris Cole, who's here tonight, and my sister and brother-in-law, Susan and Robert Simmons, for being here to share this honor with me. I'm truly grateful for their love and support. Thank you very much. <laughs>